Hey guys, this is Al from TechAndCompany.com. Today I'm going to be doing a review of Chrome Vox. Now, for those of you who are unfamiliar with Chrome Vox, I'm going to explain what it is. It's a Google Chrome extension that you can find, of course, in the Google Chrome Store. Now, this extension allows your web pages um, to be read to you if you're searching the web and let's say you find an interesting article but you're a little tired you you're you just want the thing read to you so you click on it and then this extension will basically read the article to you or whatever the rep web page is and it'll actually um, read your emails to you if you want it to read your emails to you now I am oftentimes looking for some things that you know make my life a little easier and I um, like technological um, solutions all right as you know from the name tech and company all right now what happens here is that this uh, uh, extension is probably a really good extension if you can stand it and let me explain what I mean I install this extension onto Google Chrome and I was using I said oh initially I was like oh this is pretty great and I, um, I had it read some emails had it read some um, some different articles and I, I was happy with it but then a few minutes into it I, I realized I said this thing is annoying because it doesn't have an off switch the developers of this software does didn't give it an off switch so that you could actually turn it off and make it quiet so it talks all the time so um, what happened was I had to actually find a way to turn it off um, and I'm gonna talk to you about that now one of the reasons why the rating is so low here um, because out of the 395 people who have downloaded this extension and installed it on the Google Chrome um, it's getting a low rating um, and it's 2.6 two stars um, that's not that great for an extension um, and the reason why is because in my opinion because it doesn't have an off switch so I'm gonna show you actually how to turn it off but I'm actually show you exactly how annoying this thing actually is before we uh, do that now I'm on um, of course Yahoo and I'm just you know, I pulled up this article here just as an example, and I'm going to show you how it works. First, I'm going to turn the thing back on because I found an extension that turned it off, but I'm going to turn it back on so you can hear what I'm talking about when I said it gets annoying. All right. Box spoke and feedback is ready. The first note, skip directly to primary article. Internal link. All right, I'm going to click on it again. First known use of the word iconic comes from 1656. And, though most of these bars haven't been around quite that long, some come damn close. Our rules for choosing an iconic bar were simple. It has to have been around since at least 1990. It has to be famous. And people need to... This is just some them. random article. I don't actually Sometimes care about what they're talking about. I just Sometimes pulled it up here. All right, let me switch this thing here because I don't drink. So it was like, um, let's see what this tar they're talking about with cake day. All right, I'm going to click on that. Home mail search new sports finance weather games answers screen flicker mobile more Firefox install the new Firefox Yahoo food search food search web profile envelope mail hell. Now it's, it's talking about a whole lot of stuff but I I can't see all mail search new sports finance weather games answers screen I am going to try to get it to go someplace else alright well let me just see if I can 1964 the Florabama lounge and package not to be confused with the yacht club option across the street is precisely what you okay now you can see that it does read articles but the thing is, it doesn't turn off. 
So that's what the problem was. And I was like, this is this has got to be it's turned off some way. All right. So anyway, um, I'm going to turn it off now with this extension that I found to turn it off. And so uh, let's go back here. All right. The extension is called Extensly. Extensi. All right. So to to turn it off you're going to need this extension um, you can use it and actually you can use Extensi for all of your um, Chrome extensions you see I have a lot of Chrome extensions because I, I use Chrome a lot with business because it's just such a good uh, browser um, Firefox is awesome but Sometimes I have to use Chrome. All right. So anyway, guys, um, that is my review um, of that Chrome Vox. And you cannot use it unless you're going to have a way to turn it off. All right. I hope that was helpful. I will talk to you guys later.